Well, the long-awaited verdict uh, when it came to the NFL and the NFLPA uh, on Deshaun Watson, the ruling has officially uh, been put in. Deshaun Watson will be suspended for 11 games. That's such a, a weird number. Um, but he's being suspended for 11 games, um, and he's also going to have a $5 million fine that they said is going to go to charity. Um, but you see... We know the NFL is a business, um, but something that like really stood out to me uh, is timing. We always talk about how timing is everything. And with Deshaun Watson, initially, uh, with the initial ruling that wasn't from the NFL, uh, it was from Sue Robinson. With the initial ruling, they gave Deshaun Watson six games. It was like, all right. And, and we knew like when, when Deshaun Watson comes back to play, it's going to be musty TV. It's going to be all eyes on Cleveland and whatever other team they're going against. So initially, his first game back was going to be against the Baltimore Ravens. This is AFC North, this rivalry game, division game, da da da, da. You get it. And, and that was going to be a, a big game, obviously. NFL would have been glued on to that game. Oh, how's Deshaun Watson going to look? How's he going to play? How's it going to be? Just like they were in this past preseason game where he finally played for the first time in, in years. But I, I don't know, man. Maybe I'm looking too deep into it, but his first 11 game suspension is like, okay, 11 game suspension, but his first game back is going to be in, at Houston against the Texans. Is that just a coincidence that that's how things worked out? That his first game back is against the Texans where all of this stuff starts? I, I, I don't know, man. May, again, maybe I'm looking too deep into it, but anyway, um, Deshaun Watson uh, is out for 11 games and, and he'll pay five million and i mean really that five mil that he'll be paying that, that ain't nothing to him you know like that that ain't nothing to him this dude literally just signed uh the a quarterback contract with the most guaranteed money ever ever and it, it's still like when you really think about everything now, again, I, I keep on saying because I don't know what happened. The only people that know what happened is Deshaun Watson and anybody else who could or could not have been involved. But to for the Browns to to actually like give a quarterback with all these allegations, all that money, with all that uncertainty, all that money that that's still I know I've said it several times, but that's still like crazy to me. It is, it is, it's crazy that they, they did that. And I was watching a segment uh, the other day. Uh, I, f I forget whether it's on ESPN or whatever it was on, but I was watching a segment the other day where uh, they were talking about Lamar Jackson and his contract negotiations with the Ravens and whatnot. And they were saying that with Deshaun Watson and his contract negotiations, when he was still on the Texans, they said that he had he had more leverage like with the Browns and these other teams than Lamar Jackson has with the Ravens. And I was like, what? <laughs> how was that possible? How does that make any sense? How would Deshaun Watson, with his situation, again, it was allegations. Who knows what happened? But how could Deshaun Watson, facing all them allegations, how could he have more leverage in contract talks than a Lamar Jackson with the... I, I just, I didn't get that. But again, this whole situation has been like, it's just been crazy. That, that's been the best way to, to say it. It's been crazy. Um, but now it's not even necessarily coming to an end, but it's coming to, can we even call it a resolution? I don't know. But it's, it's coming to, a, there, there's been a decision. There's been a decision on what his punishment is going to be with the NFL. Now, um, if you've been following the NFL long enough, you know the NFL, they have a lot of inconsistencies. Uh, when it comes to suspension, when it comes to what they punish players for and whatnot. Uh, and it's just, it's, it's, it's wild. It, it is very wild. Um, but it just gives you another reminder that imperfect people, they cannot rule over imperfect people. It's just, there's always going to be hiccups. There's always going to be mistakes. There's always going to be problems. There's always going to be errors. There's always going to be issues every single time. Um... But yeah, this this is just it's just been crazy. I mean, I don't even know what else to say about it. Um, but yeah, so that's it. Deshaun Watson, uh, he'll be making his NFL season debut against the Texans. Uh, one thing that I think most people figured, uh, especially with the NFL, like, come on, we know, like, again, it's a business. It is a business. 
I think most people figure like Deshaun Watson was not going to be suspended for the entire year. It's like, come on, like, I, I don't think anybody thought that he was going to be. Some people may have thought that he should be, but I know nobody thought that he was going to be. Like, realistically, when you think about it, you think about the NFL, it's like, hey, NFL is a business, they ended in it to make money. Yeah, that he wasn't going to be on the whole year. So it's no surprise that he'll be back uh, this season. And we'll see how he's back. Um, I'm, I'm, I, you know what? That's around uh, flexing time, too. That's around where the NFL, they can start flexing games and whatnot. Let me check one thing. Let me see. Okay, that game is on December 4th at 1 p.m. for now. For now. Do not be surprised. Don't be surprised if that game ends up getting flexed. Even if it's just flexed to an afternoon game. But do not be surprised if it ends up getting flexed because it will be the NFL's opportunity. Again, NFL is a business. You got whenever you think about a lot of stuff that happens with the NFL, you have to always remember in not only the back, but in the front of your mind, NFL's a business, NFL's a business, NFL's a business. Man, why the NFL do that? It's a business. Why do they capitalize on that? It's a business. What are they taking advantage of that for? It's a business. It's a business. NFL is a business. So do not be surprised if they end up flexing this game for it to be later on. So it can really be all eyes on the return of Deshaun Watson. Why? Because it's a business. We out.